Hi, this is Inji Gadala, Application Engineer for Go Engineer. Today I'm going to show you how to use SolidWorks Electrical Libraries. Libraries are used to store data. Also, they can be used as filter criteria in addition to the more commonly used properties such as classification. This provides a simple way for engineers to store and access different data types. Libraries can also be used to manage imported data as it's possible to define the library that symbols or title blocks will be associated once they're important. I will show you how individual projects can have specific libraries available, which will help reducing irrelevant data not required to complete specific tasks. Let's go ahead and switch to SolidWorks Electrical. All available libraries exist under the Libraries tab, Libraries Manager. The manager will allow you to create, delete, and even examine the library's property. Starting with an archive project, we'll go to the command manager and click on projects, configuration, project, and then the libraries palette. This will list all the available libraries for the project. And this is where we can enable specific library to make it available during symbol placement. To disable all libraries but the Go Engineer symbol, I will hold down the shift key on the keyboard and uncheck one and as you see, the command will propagate to all and unchecking them with a single click. Then I will click elsewhere to clear the selection and then I will check only the Go Engineer symbols, then click OK. Let's see how we can use the library as a filter. So I will double click on a single line diagram schematic document and then I will insert the symbol from the line diagram tab, insert symbol. I will switch to the filters tab and now in addition to the traditional way of filtering using classification, I will use the library pull down. Notice how I can only see now the available library Go Engineer symbols, which I enable within the library's palettes from the project configuration and that helps reducing the irrelevant libraries and accelerates the process. At any time, you can go back to the project configuration and enable or disable specific library that associate to symbols, cables, macros, title block, or even manufacturer part. For example, if I wish to check another library to the project, I will go back to the project configuration, libraries palette, and then I will enable the line diagram library. Now, if I go back to place another symbol, the line diagram library is available in the pull down menu. This has been Inji Gadala with Go Engineer. I hope you enjoyed the quick video on how to use SolidWorks electrical libraries.